hand, people are disgusted with, with violence. What happened in Kabul yesterday? A couple of bombs and then so many people die and it goes on. So right from the family level, there's violence within families to the international level, there's violence at all levels. And how much money is being spent for organizing violence? If you go to the army, they will measure your height, your weight, and your chest, and all that. And Gandhi's measurement was, will you speak truth? And then, ahimsa, satya, asteya, brahmacharya, so on, so on, so forth. And one of the very important rules is fearlessness. Sarvatra Bhayavardhana, fearlessness everywhere there. And there, uh, well, the, the, the answer comes there because all the people who are using the bomb, they always think there is no other way. So Gandhi said there is another way. So during my camps, in fact, I've had camps, three camps in Bangladesh, uh, four camps three in Indonesia, and three in uh, Nepal. I'm very eager to do one in Pakistan, but then it's not in pa Pakistani young people have come into my camps. Mm -hmm. So what has been helping me in camps is, one is doing manual work, sweating. And uh, there I see there's a great potential and working together in the hands. The others were there, Hindu, Muslim, Sikh, Isha, and so on. But then a couple of them, Jewish was not there in Gandhi's prayer. I said, I had Jews by there earlier. And uh, Baha'i, because Baha'i is only 2,000 years old. So a small bit, half a minute or so. But then we do silence. I call it the music of silence. And wherever there have been uh, a disturbance recently Delhi, uh, what do you call that near, very busy area in Delhi has some problem, uh, masjid and uh, temple and so on. And uh, I had a camp in Kingsway camp and all of us, about 400 or so, we went to that area. Then I said, because I had 400 of my own boys and girls in the crowd, I said, now we do a couple of minutes of music and this is going to be the music of silence come on let us all do music of silence such a wonderful change came into that halla place and there is great uh, potential but our boys and girls took out uh, peace processions in that area and the police were so impressed first they were not allowing them to go but then after a couple of days they saw their procession and uh, slogans like Jati Pati Ke Bandhan Thodo Bharat Jodo Bharat Jodo and Sab Dharmo Ka Ho Samman Mano Mano Ek Samman This is some of the, in fact I send these slogans to the Prime Minister you say Bharat Jodo come on look these are the slogans that we had Hindu, Muslim, Sikh, Isai, Aapas Meham Sabahan or Bhai Non-violence in action I saw was experienced was the Chambal Valley and the first uh, the kite surrender was when Acharya Vinoba Bhave was marching through that area. Uh, then one by one the decades came and 20 decades surrendered. So that was a great event, uh, but was not taken seriously, especially the police people were very kind of angry because even in the tea shops, people would be talking, look, blacks and crooks of rupees, the government is spending, but this Baba came and then without any mining, any amount, 20, the strongest accounts, because they're all, they all belong to Man Singh's gang. For violence also, you need an organization. It is an army. And the Taliban also, they are not organized like an army, but then they have their code of discipline, they have the leadership, they have everything. And secondly, money, 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 money. How much money is being spent today uh, for preparation of violence? That is, violent army, uh, plus weapons. 
it's, it's uh, unimaginable. So we have to think in terms of, the world has to think in terms of alternative to the gun. And within the context of India, I see young people are the alternative to the gun. Chambal Valley, we tried that. And uh, love and faith would replace the gun. Otherwise, it was gun this side, that gun that side. So we must initiate more and more such uh, experiments, experiences. And ultimately, one day the world must accept love is the alternative to the gun.